Hey guys, it is Marianne from Thrive with your tip of the day. And today I want to talk to those of you who are putting together more technical documents, large structured reports, anything that's going to refer to something outside of your document. One of the tools that you can use inside Microsoft Word is the citations tool. And what this does is it allows you to build out a bibliography that you can refer back to this over and over again for your document. So it's a great way for you to be able to do two tasks in your document at the same time without having to manually go back later and make sure that you've got all of those references in. It's also really handy because once you've built that reference, you can use it again and again as a citation in your existing document. So you can go to an existing source or you can add new sources as you go. You'll find it under the references tab in Microsoft Word. So from the ribbon at the top, references and then insert citation and what it will do is it will help you build that bibliography which you can then install at the end of your document as well. There are loads of different ways you can do it. Um, you can do it in the APA style which is the sort of standard or default option but there are loads that suit. So depending on if you're doing something like a university essay or a high school assignment or a research report you can make sure that your referencing tools match the systems and requirements of the submission so that you don't have any issues at the end and you're not wasting your valuable time working on those elements when you could be getting on with the content in your document. References, insert citation, two birds, one stone, get it done.